Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy minecraft video but today I'm gonna be showing you guys something really awesome now Mark my friendly zombie has gone ahead and ran off he is so scared of bees so what I wanted to do today is go ahead and find out why are bees so scary and especially what do they live like so I've gone ahead and gotten loads of bee spawners also loads of bee nests, some beehives, a bit of honeycomb, a bit of honey blocks, and also loads of honey bottles. It's going to be so cool today. But before we get started guys, I do want to go ahead and ask you all to subscribe because I noticed so many of you guys are actually watching my videos, but you aren't subscribed. It'll be awesome. And don't forget, you can check out my brand new merch in the description down below. But these bees will definitely be wearing my merch because if we go ahead and spawn them around the block, we should hopefully figure out what they do all day. Perfect. One around here and then another one right around here. And I want to go ahead and actually put some beehives gathered right outside baby zombie's house. Perfect. I think this is going to be the best day ever. Now, if Mark my friendly zombie was here, he would already be hiding inside the treehouse. That's how scared he is. But I want to go ahead and find out if we can actually eat any of these. Wait. Here we go. Cool. What did we get? No sugar rush? Gosh, this is actually mental. And it seems that we've got loads of honey blocks that I want to go ahead and pretty much put around everywhere. I want the bees to think of this place as their beautiful home. Perfect. Well, guys, here we go. Let's go ahead and spawn some of these bees. <gasps> cool. Look how cute they look. This is actually awesome. Oh, they're amazing. Now, some of them get a little bit tired, so they go ahead and rest on the floor. And most of them will probably go inside their beehive. Gosh, this is actually amazing. Now, I'm not sure if these bees are trying to gather some sort of pollen or if they're trying to find some sort of flowers or anything. Wait, maybe that's what we're missing. Flowers, of course. These bees are going to have to travel so far to find some flowers. Oh, he's found one. Oh, that is so cute. I think he loves it so much. Now, I'm so glad Marie had the idea ages ago to go ahead and give out so many flowers right outside her house. Look, they're getting all the pollen and they're pretty much taking it right outside the house. Here we go. Let's see what's going to happen. Ah, oh! <laughs> it disappeared. Gosh, being in the life of a bee is actually really cool. Now, it seems like this bee hasn't found anything. That one around there hasn't found anything either. It just seems like the only flowers around are right outside Marie's house or scattered everywhere else. Well, guys, I want to go ahead and actually see what happens inside all of these crazy beehives. You ready? I'm going to teleport inside. Here we go. Okay, we've been spawned inside some sort of beehive or some honeycomb. And it seems like these are the holes that all the bees go in to go ahead and leave their pollen. But it seems like there's a chest. And it's given me some sort of bronze honey-like sword. And also a Vespid Queen and also a Vespid. I need to go ahead and find out if I can actually kill these things. Now, this is what I'm trying to do. I want to see what the life is like as a bee. So we need to go ahead and play so many of these crazy things and pretty much get used to them. Wait, no! Gosh, that was so close. And it's given us some sort of flower-like thing. Hmm, I want to go ahead and actually find out what these things do. We've got Popolis. It's some sort of like bee-like blood. Gross. Okay, let me go and spawn a few more of these. Wow, there's so many of them. No, <laughs> stay back. Gosh, these guys are so strong. Ugh, this is disgusting. I need to stay away from every single one of these. Now, I am really glad that they've actually gone ahead and given me a lot more of these, which I can pretty much go ahead and show Mark how not to be afraid. Now, that's a great thing as well. If Mark, my friend, your zombie is really afraid, the good thing is, is that these guys are so easy to kill. So if you get really frightened, you can just kill him. But we're going to try our hardest not to do that. And I do have loads of bez wax, which is actually pretty much exactly what we eat our honey with. And we've got so much clay to stick it all together. Okay, let me go and spawn the Vespid Queen. <gasps> Wait! The Vespid Queen is so strong! No! And it's pretty much poisoned me! Stay back, Evil Queen! I'm so sorry I have to do this! Oh, thank goodness! I wasn't sure if I would actually be able to survive the Queen and pretty much get out of here. Now, thankfully, they give me so much propolis again, so I'm just going to go ahead and store it all in the corner because I don't want to kill all of these bees and pretty much destroy the world. So I want to keep it all safe. But I do want to know exactly what they think like. So let's go ahead and put all this back. Perfect. And there we go. And some up here and another one up there. And let's go and chuck all this clay back inside. Now, the chest is pretty much the base of all the bees. So as long as I put everything back inside, I should be okay. 
Now, Mark, my friend, is somebody was telling me, maybe I love bees because I look like one. Look at all my colors. <laughs> this is exactly what I was talking about. And my sword could be my stinger. Well, let's go and spawn another Vespid Queen. <gasps> Wait, no! Okay, let's try and do this. Ah, stay away, I'm so sorry. Please, don't hurt me. It's giving me plague, poison, and penetration. Of course, that makes complete sense. Okay, let's chuck all this back inside. And perfect. Now, I do have one more thing to go and do. I've gone ahead and figured out where they live. But I want to figure out how they live. So I actually want to go ahead and actually spawn into a Vespid. So guys, let's do this. Mark, I'm coming out and I'm going to be a crazy bee. Ah, oh, it worked. Guys, this is actually awesome. I knew we could become a bee. Mark, watch out. <laughs> this is actually so cool. I knew we could actually become a crazy queen one day. But guys, it seems like Mark, my friendly zombie, has gone ahead and actually removed all my honey items. All the bees have probably migrated somewhere else, which is actually really sad. But I wish we could actually become a proper bee. It doesn't seem like this one wants to fly. Maybe we are just too fat. Look at this crazy thing. I wonder how many more bees we can actually go ahead and spawn inside us. Do you know what, guys? I want to turn into another awesome bee. Now, the only thing about this is that it does seem like we are very noisy. And I couldn't actually live like this forever. Mark, I know you're scared of bees, but it's me. I promise you it's just me. <laughs> this is actually so cool. I can't believe today that we had enough time to go ahead and transform into a bee. Mark, my funny zombie, is going to be so, so happy. Gosh, I think I'm ready to go ahead and turn back into a human again. So, guys, let's do this. Here we go. Gosh, it was disgusting. Ugh, gross. Well, guys, I think we've had such a fun day, and Baby Zombie is loving it so much as well. <sighs> yep, he definitely agrees. Being a bee is definitely really strange. But I did like the little cute ones. So what I'm going to do is pretty much spawn so many bees that Mark, my friendly zombie, has to love them. And he can't run anywhere. Mark, stay right there. I'm, I'm going to go inside my house and find out if I've actually got any more bee spawners. Ugh, I love my house. Let's have a look what we have. Ah, oh, perfect. I knew it. Now, I am going to put on my full iron outfit because sometimes bees do sting you even if they're friendly. And perfect. So let's go and get out everything else. And I do want to also plant loads of flowers everywhere because bees love flowers. And I'm going to be the most friendliest person towards bees ever. Let's put some more blue flowers around. And then maybe some around this side. And perfect. And I'm going to make sure Mark, my friendly zombie, loves them all. Wait, where's Mark gone? Mark! <laughs> Gosh, Mark, my friendly zombie, has already ran off. This guy is really scared of everything. Okay, let's do this. Perfect. And awesome. And now is the time to go ahead and spawn loads of bee nests everywhere. And I do hope Mark, my friendly zombie, can eventually love them all. I love bees so much, and I want them to be super friendly. There we go. Perfect. Keep going. Oh, look, there's even some baby ones. That is so cute. Oh, this is awesome. Guys, I think we've done such a good job. All of these bees now are going to go around every single flower and pretty much crave more pollen and more honey for us. It's going to be amazing. I can't wait to fill my stomach and all my teas and everything with wonderful honey. Do you know what? I think these ones are so cool. Look, they've all got pollen all over them. <laughs> this is actually awesome. Guys, I think we've done the best job ever. This is so cute. Even the little baby ones are trying to do as much hard work as they can. Go on, babies. You guys are awesome. Now, I think this is... Wait! No! I didn't mean to touch them. This is not good at all. Guys, I'm so sorry. Guys, I think I've really messed up. I accidentally hit one of them, and I think I've really screwed that one up. So, guys, I will see you soon with the crazy Minecraft video. And before we go, I do want to go ahead and show you guys my merch because I've worked so hard on it. So, don't forget to check out the link in the description where you can go ahead and actually buy my face on a t-shirt. It's the coolest skin ever. It's a fire skin. So, guys, I will see you soon with the crazy Minecraft video. And don't forget to like this video. Subscribe down below the button is red. And don't forget to press the notifications bell. And as Mark, my friendly zombie would say, which means peace out. So guys, I'll see you soon. Peace out. Don't forget, you can go ahead and buy Mark the plushie in the description down below.